What's going on everybody? This is DJ Buster B. It's been a while since I've done like a video on like tutorial kind of video. But uh, this one I had to put out there because I know a lot of you guys aren't running Xiaomi Show Express with a wireless device like you know your uh, cell phone or a tablet or something like that. But I haven't seen a lot of guys using it. I, I know um, Mikey Mike and I think DJ Rock and Rob. Those are like the only two guys I see on YouTube that are using that kind of stuff or even had videos on how to do it. So I've had mine running for a little while with it. I just want to show you guys how I did it. I'm not going to go too much into great detail as far as how to configure it because those tutorial videos are on YouTube. I can show you right here. All I did was search for Show Express Wi-Fi and they have all kind of videos on how to set it up. And it's very, very simple to do. I mean, just follow the steps. It took me about five minutes and I had it set up. I mean, they go by step by step on how to do it on Android and it's also available on Apple. But I have mine on just on a Samsung, this uh, Galaxy phone right here. But you see right here, um, this is my Show Express one. This is my, it's an old laptop I just use just for lighting only. It's nothing special, just only thing on here is Xiaomi Show Express. If I turn my phone on, see right here I have um, some colors. I've got one light right here on the floor. If I hit, uh, let's say, blue. See, light comes on, turn off blue. It's off, I wanna go red, red. And this stuff is very, very simple to set up. Um, all you need is a basic, um, this is an old Belkin, a very low end wireless G router. Um, it doesn't even need to be on the internet. It's just used as a wireless bridge for your laptop to connect to here and your phone or tablet to connect to here. I paid, I think it was $7 for this thing on eBay with a buy it now. I mean, it was it's used, but it's, it's worked perfect. I used it on our last gig when we did the wedding. And that was how exactly how I set my lights up in the ceiling. And I was upstairs with my lights and I could control and see how things were looking just up there by using my phone right here, just going through my scenes and everything. I didn't have to run all the way downstairs and control, you know, just to click on some lights right here and change some different colors or yell down to the room like, Royale, go down there and hit this button. I could do it all from my phone just upstairs. But I'm gonna show you a couple tips. Exactly, you know, what I had to, I came through a couple problems and I figured out what the problem. One of the main things is when you're connected to Wi-Fi, you see I got the Wi-Fi symbol right here, and I'm connected to, I named this router uh, Xiaomi Show Express. And if you're connected at a venue, let's say you're um, at that venue and they have free Wi-Fi. If, you, if you're using a phone, if you're using a tablet, you don't have to worry about this, but if you're using a, a phone, you might want to consider this. Um, I was connected to the wireless router at the venue, which was mine, and within like 10 minutes, Everything like right now it says connected, it would jump off and say turned off. And then my phone was going back to a regular mobile network. And what I figured out was that um, your phone is always, if you're using a phone, it's always want to connect to the internet to try to get updates or, you know, Facebook or pinging. It's always pinging the towers, like it needs an internet connection. If you connect to a wireless router and your phone is still in mobile network also, and your phone does not see an internet connection with this wireless router because this is just a, a router doesn't have any internet connected to it. If your phone does not see an active data connection, you know, where it's getting information from the internet, it's gonna turn off that Wi-Fi and go back to your mobile network and try to connect. It's gonna turn off that Wi-Fi and try to connect back to the mobile network just so it can continue to receive information back and forth. So what I had to do was I had to put my phone in airplane mode and then connect to this wireless router and I'm connected to fine, just perfect. But if you have a tablet, or something like that, you don't have to worry about that because the tablet is usually only Wi-Fi anyway. And so once you connect to this router, this router right here, your tablet doesn't have like a mobile network where it's trying to use a cell phone connection and get updates and all that kind of thing. So you might want to put your phone in airplane mode and you should be good to go. Once you have it connected to it, it'll say connected and that's about it. And after that, you, you download the uh, the Xiaomi Show Express app. They have it for Apple and Android. And when you go into settings, it's very simple. Try to see if I can do this on the, without any glare. And your live IP address, that's gonna be the, all of this is on the tutorial videos on YouTube. That IP address is the IP address that your laptop uses to connect to this wireless router right here. So if you go like to, this is older Windows XP. I mean, it's, this laptop is never on the internet or anything. It's just used for lighting. So if you, like in XP, you just go to status for your Wi-Fi, your wireless connection. And up here, go like to support and the IP address that this wireless router is giving my laptop is 192.168.2.2 .2. 
So on your actual Show Express app right here, that's the IP address that you put right here because you want your phone to connect to your laptop so it can control the light scenes. So that's why you have to put that IP address into there. And live port by default is 7348. And I didn't put a live password because I'm just using it. It's just me using this thing, this thing and that's it. So once you have all that set up, you just hit um, connect to live right here. And it connects in and you have all your, your scenes right here. Uh, light scene that you have in all these tabs right here. That's what all of this is right here. So example, I wanna hit um, strobes right here. If I tap in strobes, that comes up. And strobes is a, a section right here that I have that has all of these different strobe effects. So right here, I could just hit, uh, let's say up lights fast strobe right here. If I hit it, you see the up light will start to strobe. And now it's strobing going through different colors. I could turn it off, I could do a fast and slow fade that I made and it's doing that. And also when you toggle these buttons here on your phone, it's toggling right here on the screen. So if I turn it off right here, you watch the color change. See, that's because it's, the phone is, is sending information to the wireless router and that's bridging it to your laptop. And that's why everything can communicate back and forth. So for more information on how to set Xiaomi Shore Express up with your wireless device, just make sure you check out the YouTube videos because this stuff is right on here. I mean, like DJ Rock and Rob, where is his? Right here, he had a detailed tutorial on how to do it. And this stuff has been out for years. And it's all kind of videos on there. Rock and Rob, uh, Mikey Mike, a few others. And they all go through the same thing, how to set up the, the port, you know, with your uh, firewall. It's, it's step by step. It's like three steps and that's it. And, and that's basically it for your laptop. And that's all you got to do. A lot of you guys probably won't have to use it. If you're DJing by yourself, you probably won't need this because most of the time if you're using Show Express, you're right there by your laptop controlling your lights. But with me, my situation, we always have two people. So I, either I'm DJing and partner, they're walking around or they're DJing. I'm out walking around and we're talking to everybody in the crowd, talking to the people, the building. I mean, we just don't stay behind the booth and hide behind the booth all night. We're just socializing, walking around, talking to people. So it can help out because I could be across the room and just say, you know, hit a button and change up the scene while he's mixing or, or Lady Fingers is mixing. I mean, I could be across the room, hit a light scene, hit some chases, some shows. You could be in front of your booth or across the room or wherever you are, you know, emceeing like bride and groom or, you know, the bridal party. And you can have your tablet or wireless device in your hand with the list of names and you can just highlight that, you know, highlight a button and then the light spin around and spotlight the door. And then you can turn it off and do another scene and you're right there away from the booth. And it's it's quite a, it's kind of cool that you're away from everything and still controlling everything wireless. I mean, I like all kinds of gadgets, so this stuff is fascinating to me. I like this kind of stuff. But I just want to put it out there to get you guys to show, show you guys that this kind of stuff is not hard to do. So you guys might want to check it out. It's another feature with Shabby Shore Express and it makes controlling your lights from anywhere in the venue as long as you have a little wireless device like this, a little router. And like I said, this one's real cheap, it works excellent. So give it a shot, it's kind of cool.